Did you know that a tennis match played in 1973 permanently changed the status of professional women's tennis? Hi, I'm Alice DeWright, and welcome back to Why Tennis. As female tennis began to gain popularity in the early 1970s, former professional tennis player Bobby Riggs protested the idea that women were worthy of playing alongside male tennis players. As a result, he challenged the number one female player in the world, Billie Jean King, to a match. A Riggs victory would undoubtedly prove that men were superior at tennis to women, as he had retired from the professional tour over 20 years prior, and King was currently in her prime. King begrudgingly agreed, and on September 30th, 1973, Billie Jean King and Bobby Riggs stepped onto the Houston Astrodome for what was dubbed the Battle of the Sexes. King easily won in straight sets with a score of 6-4-6-3-6-3. Roughly 90 million people watched the match worldwide. King's victory was wildly influential for professional female tennis. It showed the world that women's tennis was exciting to watch, and they could play the sport as well as anyone else. King has been vocal about the match ever since, as it helped her to found the WTA, which we covered in episode 14. In fact, it was so important that Emma Stone portrayed King in the 2017 blockbuster called Battle of the Sexes. All in all, Billie Jean King's success, impact, and legacy on professional female tennis are undeniable, and there is good reason the US Open's campus is called the Billie Jean King National Tennis Center. Thanks for sticking around, and I hope to see you next time as we talk about Serena Williams. Folks, that was Alistair Wright with this week's edition of Why Tennis. Come back next week for more.